Ooh, what's going on guys? I'm Jake the Offensive Gamer and this is Watch Dogs Part 13. Uh, sorry, I know I haven't made a video on this in a couple of days now. Uh, that's because I've been really busy with a lot of other stuff. Uh, you know, between recording for Murdered Soul Suspect and a couple of things that are going on in my personal life. I've been a little bit busy and just haven't been able to keep up with everything at the moment. Um, but I still, you know, I, I haven't forgot about for, 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 uh, forgotten about this series, and I, I am doing it still. You don't need to worry about that. Just, uh, it's been really hectic lately. So, uh, I think everything's gonna get back to normal pretty soon, so, um, yeah, anyway, let's, uh, go ahead and get this going. Yep. Indiscretions, tendencies, everything Quinn needs to keep his guests loyal. Got it? Now pretend this thing is full of solid fucking gold bricks. What is he doing? None of your business, lady. What is he doing? Keep walking. Fuck off. Out of it. Yeah, you hear me, mister? You are out of it. Yeah, well, you're a cunt. How about that? I do, it's moving. Wait, I can't believe it. What? Quinn's guys are pulling some old school gangster shit. Briefcase swap. Really? Do those actually work? Never seen one of these. Why are they doing this? Did they fool CT on us? Anybody watching through a monitor would see every swap. They're trying to confuse the detection software. Interesting. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. What are you doing? Jesus, dude. He just... I, like, seriously, I'm kind of confused. Oh, he's just gonna throw it overboard? Oh, he's putting on the boat. Okay. I guess I need a boat. Probably that one over there. He got the case on a boat heading up river. I got a bike here. I'm gonna follow. Oh. Maybe I can see where they're going. Give me a sec. What do you have nearby? My guess, this will be a short trip. There's another drop for another pickup. Okay. Nope. Nope. Wait. There's an old marina bought by Lucky Quinn in 1967. That's got to be it. Says it's been closed to the public since the 80s. All right, this is actually kind of cool. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Get out of my way now. Alright, I gotta catch up. Gotta catch up quick. AIDS. Oh shit on my dick. Fuck me. Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Get back on the bike. Get back on the bike. Now. Get on the bike, you motherfucker. Am I supposed to get on one of these boats or something? That's what I'm kind of gathering from this. What I'm kind of confused as to what that was all about. I like the music right now. It's pretty cool. Get out of my way! What the fuck are you doing? Idiot. Jesus. Just surrounded by stupid people. Alright, so I guess just I'm here now. Alright, locate the briefcase unseen again. Alright, well that will be probably a little bit difficult, but nothing I can't handle. Just swim my way over. I'm 
sending the guest list from the case. Whatever this auction is, the club's not taking chances. Security will be tight. Okay, so we'll find you a suitable identity. Not a regular. Someone from out of the country. A guy they won't recognize. Okay. Okay. This one. Can you pull off a Mr. Pang? I don't think so. Any Europeans? Nicholas Crispin. 32 years old. Expat American. Hasn't been back in 12 years. That's the one. Oh my god. They list his preferences. This man is sick. And filthy rich, too. Will anyone miss him? What do you mean, miss him? Clara, if I'm stealing his identity, I can't have him around blowing my cover. I can't keep him alive. Oh. No, well, I guess not. My sister's missing, Clara. I'm gonna do whatever it takes to get her. Listen, if this is too much for you, you can walk away. I'll understand. No, I'm fine. Nobody's going to miss this dog. This is a good match. He's supposed to pick up his car at the dealership. All right. I'll meet him there. Once again, reiterating, Aiden Pierce is a selfish piece of shit. Just saying, not the typical protagonist, I must say. Not saying that I hate his character or anything, I'm just saying that, you know, this he's not a good guy. Hi, this is Aiden, Jack's uncle. I want to make sure things are going okay there. First, I want to know if things are okay with Nikki. We haven't heard from her. She's still working things out. She just needs a little more time. Well, Jackson misses her terribly. She should at least give him a call. I can tell he's restless. He's not happy here. I understand. And I'll let her know. If you have any problems with Jax, anything at all, if he wanders off or anything, you call me right away. I will. You take care of that sister of yours. Yeah. I am. Okay then. Um Let's see, can I can I fast travel? Uh be kind of pointless. All right. So, I will see you guys in a second. Forgetting Claire's not used to this. I'm gonna scare her off if I'm not careful. Crispin's my ticket into the auction and my only shot at getting close to Iraq. He needs to disappear. Hack the CTOS box to find Crispin. Yes, sir. Um. So, up to this point, I mean... I guess I can give a, a fair opinion on this game, uh, considering... This is too exposed. Better go in quietly. Uh, considering that, you know, I've played a decent sample size up to this point. And, I mean, not by any stretch of the imagination is this a bad game. But I am reasonably disappointed yeah, I'm, that I would have been caught. That would have been bad. Alright. I... what the fuck? Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. I'm supposed to do the other one first. Fuck. Alright, that... I... <laughs> I messed that one up. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. There we go. Sure does purr, doesn't it? Exotic and fast. Mr. Quinn didn't know which color you'd like, so um, you can take whichever.
must have a schedule or something on his phone. Can't let him get away. All right, now that I've disabled all reinforcements to my knowledge, um, I think I can just go ahead and shoot him without any issues. I mean, obviously there will be issues, that being that these guys will all try to kill me pretty much the second that it happens. If I'm going to do this, I might as well go all out. Up. Crispin was on his way to pick up something called the Poppy Special. It's at a club called Infinite 92. Infinite 92. No official listings. I see mention of it in some thread here. Oh, looks like it's a gentleman's a dish club. Underground, of course. So the Poppy Special is a woman. That fits the profile Quinn had on Crispin. I doubt Poppy would have survived the meeting. What kind of auction is this? I think we both know the answer to that. I'm going to the club now. Crispin's invite is there. Go to the private lounge, Infinite 92. This is a continuation of this mission, so I'm just going to go ahead and keep going with it. Um. Yeah. Ah! Sorry, I'm so sorry. I feel like that ended up actually working out pretty well, to be honest. Um. It, uh. You know, I had I disabled all reinforcements, so nobody else was called in. And uh, even though it feels sloppy, I really am not sure how else I could have gone about doing that whole thing. So I killed Crispin, and then I just got the fuck out of there. I mean, it was really pretty simple and um, pretty easy. I mean, I didn't stick around. I didn't try to kill the other guys, uh, which the game made pretty evident that wasn't uh, that that wouldn't have been a necessary course of action. So, yeah. Anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, cut to when we get to the club, so see you guys in a second. Here I am, all monstered up for the monster ball. Hey, just keep your hands as safe as little as possible. Crispin's as fucked up as they say, I'm going to draw attention. Just find the auction invite and get out. The poppy special. Very good, Mr. Crispin. A signature dish prepared especially for you. We'll hang on to any weapons. Mr. Crispin, right this way, please. What happened to the guards assigned to you, sir? They couldn't keep up. All right, then. Am I going to see some titties over here at some point? Yeah, you don't got shit. Licensed mixologist. Fuck you. I can mix drinks together. Nobody gives a shit. Mr. Quinn wanted to ensure you're comfortable. On his behalf, we offer you a special gift. Please, enjoy as much as you like. Special gift, eh? What's your name? Poppy? I know about you. What you do to girls. No, it's not. It's okay. I'm done. Crispin, is everything to your liking? You interrupt me again and you're next. I'm not gonna hurt you. Just come with me. I can help you. No. They'll find me. 
They said you were a monster. You're not Crispin, are you? My name is Pierce. Okay, so that was uh, pretty short-lived. <laughs> huh. I don't care. I don't care about your personal life. Do not give a shit. Whatsoever. My gun. We hope you'll come back again. I guess they just assume that I come really quickly. L seriously, I was in there for like 15 seconds. I need a favor. I gotta get Poppy out of this place. Call Infinite 92, pretend you're Crispin's assistant. Tell them I insist that Poppy be delivered to me at the auction. Yes, okay. She'll be there. I'll make sure of it. Maybe Crispin had to die, but at least we can save this girl. That's something, right? I'm not sure we can add things up so cleanly, but we're gonna get her out. Alright then. Sorry this video has been pretty, um, not entertaining. Uh, I don't know. Creative juices aren't flowing right now, I suppose. I did a lot of videos for Murdered Soul Suspect in the last few, uh, hours, so maybe, maybe I, maybe I need to go ahead and stop for a little bit. I, I, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I do apologize. I, uh, I wasn't exactly um, interesting in this part, so I'll, I'll, I'll try to make it better next time, okay? And it doesn't seem like there's any sort of soliloquies or phone calls that are happening, so I'm just going to go ahead and stop the video here. So if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe and all that, and I will see you guys next time. <laughs>